Hi YouTube, Tim Unkert here from UnkertEducation.com. In this video, I'm going to look at installing custom themes for the Genie IDE. So we have here, once we install Genie, we have our default theme. And this is an HTML file here. And I can also change color schemes to the alternative theme. Okay, So there's two themes that are available, but I can get quite a bit more. So to do that, I'm going to open up a browser and I'm going to search for Genie Themes. Okay, The first result that will come up is from genie.org download themes. I'm going to click on that and you'll see I have a bunch of themes here. So for instance, let's say I wanted to use Darkula. I'm going to click download. I can then right click and save as. I then want to go to my Linux files and go to show hidden files. I'm going to go into my .config folder and then I'll, I have a folder here genie. I'm going to go in there and then I'm going to go into color schemes. Before I save, this will try and get me to save it as a .txt file. So if you can see down at the bottom it says doc or .conf and then .txt. I want to get rid of the .txt and then I'm just going to click save. While the Genie editor is still open, I don't even need to restart it. I can go to View, Change Color Scheme, and now I have Darkula showing up. And I can change to Darkula, a pretty sweet theme. I like light themes, so I'm going to show you again with Notepad++. So I'm going to go down here to Notepad++, click Download, and then right-click Save As. Again, in that folder in the .config Genie Color Schemes. I'm going to get rid of the .txt extension, save it, go back up, go to View, Change Color Scheme, and now I can change it to Notepad++. Pretty sweet. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.